Hey girl, what's up with you? Wait a minute, is this the right number? It's um the loser line. Come on, just call me back. If you've never heard the loser line before, it works like this. Let's say someone comes up to you while you're out at the club and tries this charming pickup line on you. Are you the CIA? Because uh-huh. I don't think the president gave you permission to torture me with those ocean blue eyes. Oh, no. <laughs> no. Is this water no, 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 no. Whatever you do, don't remove your blue contacts and throw them at him like a discus in the Olympics. Instead, blink at him in Morse code and tell him you're down for whatever. <laughs> and that's when you give him the number to the loser line, so hopefully he leaves an awkward voicemail we can play on the air. Voicemails like this one. Next message. Hey, what's up, Marissa? Uh, <clears throat> listen, I know uh, I know you m- might think that I have kids and all, and I was just calling to straighten things out and let you know, I actually don't have any kids. Uh, my sister has a metric ton of kids, actually, <laughs> and that's part of the reason why I don't want to have kids. Like, I feel like we're on the same page here about not wanting a bunch of little rugrats that, you know, that, you know, just got to wipe their butts all the time. I mean, no one wants that. People act like they do. They don't. They're just trying to convince other people to be as miserable as they are. At any rate, uh, hope that clears things up. And uh, I look forward to hearing back from you. Kids, all right? Next oh, message. Oh, all right. I had to add that little well, spice in the yeah. end. He must be their favorite uncle. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Is that true, Brooke? Is it? Do you not enjoy wiping children's butts, or does it give you to joy? That part, not awesome. But oh. the rest of it makes up for it. Like, oh. you know, it mm. balances it all out. Kinda you're not, like you're being, just telling yourself that uh-huh. to convince uh-huh. yourself. Kind of like being friends with me, Brooke. Oh. You, know, you don't enjoy the wiping part, but everything else, we have oh. a good time. <laughs> so dumb. <laughs> hey, man, I'll wipe for you. Thanks, brother. Yeah, I'm glad while. you guys got that coming. You guys are my best friends. Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> Next message. Hello, Lynn. Hey, this is Kyle. Remember me from the other night? Uh, just wondering, I haven't heard from you. I, you're uh, waiting for that uh, that wonderful food that you, you make. You, you told me you're a chef. And um, I was just wondering if we could w- mix it up, maybe come over and cook for me. I'm, I'm a terrible cook. My last girlfriend, she was such a good cook. And she she left me. And now I've, I've been eating ramen noodles and <laughs> butter sandwiches and tomato and mayonnaise i I just don't i was wondering if you're going to give me a call because um yeah i need that i need that good cooking that you were telling me about uh (laughs) chef it up and uh i'm i got a big appetite and i'm ready to eat next message oh man Uh, i've heard that's the way to do it yeah that's how you get Mm. to a woman's heart you call her up and beg her to cook for you and mention your ex and the terrible diet you Uh have (laughs) you can't even put together a sandwich tomato and mayonnaise that's the only thing you can figure out how to put on it next message hey amber uh me uh (laughs) so look i was thinking you know um i'm gonna be going out of town and uh you mentioned you're a nurse, and I was wondering if you could take care of my chinchilla. <laughs> you know, since you take care of humans, and chinchillas really shouldn't be a problem. A uh, little about him. He's four. He loves to be pet on his head. But uh, be careful, you know, because he will pee on you. What? But hey, I'm into that. <laughs> uh, Okay. Uh, all right. Uh, get back to me. Next message. Oh, no. Wow. I- I'm speechless. That was yeah, all yeah, confusing. Was yeah. I thought chinchilla was like a euphemism for something oh. at first. And I'm like, oh. oh, no, I think he really has a pet chinchilla. <laughs> yeah, that's a little furry chinchilla. Mm. And one of my favorite parts in the loser lines is when you can hear people want to take back their words. Yeah, they're like, mm. if like, I could hit a delete button yeah. right now, I would. <laughs> Why did I say that pee thing? I don't think he was thinking he wanted to take it back. Oh, you don't think so? I think he was having a, like a little vision in his mind, like a little oh. fantasy going on, just thinking about his chinchilla peeing on his lap. You might be right. He's like, oh, yeah. Oh. <laughs> Next message. You got it, you got it, bad. When you're on the phone, hang up and you call You got it, you got it, bad. If you miss a you got your friend saying You got it, bad. When you're stuck in the house, you don't want to have fun. You're all I think about, Jay. You're all I'm thinking about. But you keep, you keep on thinking about somebody else. You got it bad. I miss you, Shane. I miss you. Next message. 
record. Oh, oh my God. How did we get how did we get audio of Alexis's message to her ex boyfriend? I thought that was me for a minute. Oh, yeah. I thought it was me. I was like, high did they get yeah, I was like, did they get this audio? Somehow? I thought it was Alexis too. Were you no drunk no last Shane weekend? on my list. So oh, okay. not me. Oh, clear. What is your ex's name? We're not gonna mention that right yeah. now. Okay. <laughs> but also it was you got it bad, so it could have been Brooke, because that's mm. back in her you know, that's more of an oh, older I song. See, yeah. I really did think it was audio from high school. <laughs> yeah, one of those classic I got dumped rock a lot. Hits. Oh, oh Brooke. Brooke. Yeah. Next message. Hey, sorry. I know it's uh super late. I totally want you to come over right now. And and, and it's it not because of, you know, <laughs> uh, I'm, I'm actually a little freaked out because uh, I, I, I live alone and there's, I think there's something in my place. Like tonight when I was getting ready for bed, I swear I saw like, oh, like this creepy kid's face in the reflection of my window. And then just a few minutes ago, I woke up hearing little kids' footsteps running around in my hallway. It's f***ing weird. Anyway, I'm under the blankets, and I need you to call me back right when you get this. Because... Hey! Holy f***! What the f***? Next message. No oh, no way. That guy had to be like totally putting on a show for her or something. Think? You're scared. I'm scared. Like that sounded like he what was if, he yeah. was scared. Yeah. About how not to get someone to come over to your house. Yeah. What if we were his last phone call oh, guy. Oh my gosh. Ah. I was thinking back to the first phone call guy. I think that ghost kid wants him to wipe his butt. <laughs> <laughs> That's your loser line. Remember, you can listen to it regularly at this time every week. Your phone tap's coming up right after this.